Foxy to Elegance here, and this video is to show you how to install Windows ME, also known as Windows Millennium Edition. First thing you want to do is you want to open your CD or DVD ROM drive and put your Microsoft Windows ME installation CD or DVD into the drive. Turn on your computer. This is the first screen that you'll come to. You'll want to hit boot from CD-ROM, start Windows setup. At this point it will load. Now you come to the setup, you hit enter. Then configure an allocated disk space and enable large disk support if over 512 megabytes. Hit enter. Go to CD, set up again. It will reload itself. At this point it will start formatting the drive for you. Now it will scan your C drive. Now it's starting to install. So it loads, hit next, then hit next if you want to install a, a default directory. It will install it for you. You have multiple different types of in installation depending on what your computer is. If it's a laptop, hit portable or compact. We're going to go with typical and install the most common components. Here you can name your computer and your work group. We're going to call this ME Foxy for now. Hit next. United States, Central Time, wherever you are and you're ready. Hit finish. This will take some time. Now that it's complete, we hit restart now to restart the computer. And then boot from hard disk. And then it will load the rest of the setup will detect all your hardware now you can put your name and your company name in if no company leave it blank hit next hit I accept on the license agreement hit next now you want to enter your key in since this is a piece of abandonware this is completely legal and you can use this key on Windows ME. You can use the same key as me. It should work on all English versions of Windows ME. Hit Next and hit Finish. Now we're going to hit Restart after everything's complete. We hit Restart, Restart the computer, hit Boot from Hard Disk. Not setting up the hardware again. It's going to install your start menu stuff, your control panel, and applications. You let it do its thing. Afterwards, we hit restart to restart again and boot from hard disk. Now we can log in with our name after ME loads. It will update our hardware information and system settings. will take a moment to load. 
after everything installs. And here we are with Windows ME. Now you can do what you please and you have successfully installed Windows Millennium Edition on your computer. Congratulations! Hope you found this helpful. Fox Elegance out.